you know, I'm gonna be honest, I'm staring blankly ahead for the past several minutes trying to kind of organize my thoughts, and I feel like that may not actually end up happening. But I kind of forced myself to click record just because I gotta start eventually. But, uh, hey there. I'm back in my room. We're going back to basics. Back to me. Hang on. There we go. Now it's exactly like the first one. Um, you know, it's funny, I feel like he's been trying to, it's funny, I feel like he's been trying to escape more often than usual, and I'm not sure why. I almost wonder if maybe it's because, um, when I was trying to get the thumbnail for the, um, the first, um, vlog, the first rambling video that I did, um, I ended up, like, I don't know, it might have freaked him out a little bit when I was trying to get the thumbnail for that one, just because, you know, it's always a bitch trying to get him to open the face of the camera. Here you go, all you, hang out on my neck. And yes, that is a reptile probably covered in salmonella that is rubbing against my face and neck. I also have been wearing this shirt for three days and have not showered in about as much time. So, <laughs> for, any, for any females that might be happening to watch this video, is, is that not the most attractive combination of facts you've ever heard a man utter? Um, uh, yeah, you know, it is funny though. I feel like, um... I feel like I've talked about that before, um, what was, yeah, it was, um, it was one of the things I ended up talking about, um, with my mom the other day, which was, um, it was, it wasn't the thing that I ended up, that I forgot that I was talking about in today's, um, gameplay video, but, um, which, by the way, you should check that out, but, um, Balan, are you trying to strangle me? Jesus. Um, I feel like he wants revenge. Um, what the fuck was I, oh, right, I, um, I was talking about how, like, I almost feel like my somewhat subpar hygiene almost kind of benefits me in some way. And when I say somewhat subpar, I don't mean, like, like, I shower on a fairly regular basis, although, as you can tell by my hair, it hasn't been in a little while. But, um, yeah, and I mean, like, I'll wash my hands when it's necessary, but, like, in terms of washing, cl cleaning them before eating or preparing food for myself, or, um you know, washing, keeping, keeping my room tidy, washing dishes in between every single use of them. It's, it's not always a thing that happens with me. And, um, a lot of you might be thinking, like, oh, gross, and don't worry, I know, I'm a disgusting creature. But, um, I almost feel like, in a way, it's sort of, be um, like, I, um, I'm gonna be honest, I probably, um, I get sick probably less often than anyone else that I know. And, like, um, I mean, I get colds every once in a while, you know, I'll get the sniffles, but it's one of those things where, like, I, um, in terms of, like, run, getting so sick that, like, I actually ran a fever, I don't even remember the last time that happened. So, like, I almost kind of feel like maybe because I exposed myself to just so many, like, viruses and bacteria and, like, all the shit that, like, my immune system kind of gets, um, just so much practice that nothing can really, nothing can make its way in anymore. Um, <laughs> maybe I'm just trying to justify my bad habits, I don't know, but... Either way, I can definitely say that I'm not contributing as much to the rise of super bacteria, so that's always a plus. Honestly, super bacteria freaking just, like, upsets me. Like, it, it really scares me. Especially because, like, um, you know, infections and shit like that, like, are horrendous. I mean, that's what, um, that's what caused the bubonic plague to be such a, um, such, just like a pandemic back in its day, and also just, um... You know, it's it's the kind of thing where without antibiotics, literally any, like, little cut or scrape that you get could become fatal. But, um, or, like, even if you get, like, a sinus infection, you know, that's, what is, child, what are you doing? Ah, jeez. See, this is what I'm talking about. He was trying to escape more than he used to. Um, sorry about that. But, yeah, so, like, if, with bacteria getting a lot more antibiotic resistant recently, it's, like... <laughs> They they have a potential to completely fail, and then we're gonna be back at the point where yeah, literally any like any just like random scrape you get could be it could be the end of you. It could be the last scrape you ever get. So hopefully that helps you sleep at night. Um, I've been looking at like the desk for the past like few seconds. I don't know why I thought that was a good thing to do. Sorry, you can see my face now. Hi, how are you? I'm, uh... Salmonella is not a concern of mine, though, if I'm going to be honest. I'm going to try to kiss his head. Oh, hey, he didn't recoil from me. I feel like sometimes I want him to bite me, almost. Like, I feel like it's kind of like a, um, it's a bridge we need to cross in our, um, like, pet master relationship. And, um, 
just so that, you know, it'll hurt, and then I can forgive him and continue to love him, and he'll continue to be pretty much, um, uh, indifferent towards me because he's not really capable of feeling attachment, but that's okay. You know, I almost feel like if I'm capable of feeling attachment for a, literally a reptilian creature, then, you know, of course, you can, um, you can probably feel some sort of, um, empathy for, you can feel some sort of empathy for, like, farm animals and shit like that. And that is the funny thing with, um, I don't want to get too preachy in this video because there are already enough vegans on YouTube to do that. And yes, for the record, if you, um, if you saw the, um, how to, how to properly deliver a speech video, that wasn't just a joke. I am actually vegan. Um, but no, there are, there are enough vegans on YouTube to kind of, I don't know, I guess, um, try to convince you to go vegan and tell you why if the animal industry is horrible. But, um, that's not really what I'm trying to do here. I'm just more, um, I guess what I'm trying to talk about is, like, um, I find it odd how a lot of people kind of deploy this argument, like, well, the animals don't care about you, so why should you care about the animals? And now, well, I'm not going to go into, like, why that argument doesn't make sense. I will just say, like, <laughs> I feel like most people, if you, um, if you were to, like, show them, you know, either animals suffering or, like, um, just put one of the put one of these creatures before them and be like, hey, w would you kill this thing? Like, most people would not do that, I don't think. So then it's kind of the thing where, like, we're trying to, they're trying to argue that you should care, but, like, I feel like most people already care about them, and they just don't want to admit it. And, like, I mean, look at, look at him. Okay, a lot of people don't like snakes, so this might not be the best example, but is, how is this thing not adorable? Here. Oh, yeah, he got scared that time. Please, please bite me, please. I've been a, I've been a bad boy. I need to stop doing this. Like, <laughs> my video, <laughs> my last um, yesterday's ramble was a little bit um, it got a little bit too suggestive. Although it does um, somehow that does remember me actually. That, or remember me when that does remind me actually that I ended up um, I ended up saying in today's gameplay video that I would talk about um, like my relationship status in a in a ramble, but like I'm not sure if I feel like doing that um. I don't know why. I'm just I'm staring at my snake now, and that's not a euphemism either. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I guess um to finish my thought from that, just because I kind of like stopped short. Um, it's not that I haven't dated people before. I've like I mean I haven't done it horribly often, but I've done it a few times. Um, and it's um. I just, because I'm a weird individual, and also I'm, I wouldn't consider myself to be the best looking, although I don't think I'm hideous either, just, you know. I, I feel like my, I feel like my presence is kind of like a, um, or my, I feel like my appearance is kind of a non-entity, and that, like, I'm just kind of typical looking, and then, like, you know, I'm not the kind of person you'd really give a second look. And then when you start to get to know me, you realize that, like, my thoughts don't function the way a sane human should. And, well, not to mention I'm very awkward and insecure, so it's just... <laughs> I feel like that's kind of the main thing where, like, you can imagine that, um, you know, my success is not, um, overwhelming with that sort of thing. But, I mean, you know, I'm not trying to get you to feel bad for me. I'm, I'm doing okay. I just, that's just a thing. It's a fact. But it's okay, because I have reptiles to, um, to hold and to cuddle with and, you know. Ah. I, I, I'm not sexually attracted to reptiles, just for the record. I'm not sure if that looked like it. <laughs> I looked a little weird when I was looking at the at the um, at the viewfinder, but um, no, that's just he has a he has a nice texture. I what what do you? I feel like he's he's kind of been trying to escape more often. Did I say that? Well, like because I don't um I remember earlier in the video I said that. I thought I might have scared him at that video, but I'm not sure if I really, if I completely explain why that is. But yeah, I feel like he's not only trying to escape from his cage more, but like, a few times when I was holding him anyway, he, um, it seemed like he kind of was slithering away from me more quickly than he usually does, or like, with more determination. So I don't know what's up with him, I don't know if he's like, traumatized, or if, I don't know, he's just like, kind of getting to the point in his life where he's like, dude, like, I don't do anything. <laughs> If only I'd reach that point in my life. But, um... Yeah, oh well. I guess, um... I don't think there's anything left for me to talk about, really. But, um, I guess be sure to like if you did, and hit the subscribe button, because I would like some more relevance. And, um... 
uh, I don't know, I'll see you in tomorrow's ramble.